Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to remove permanent marker. So I've got a really nice new white tabletop here. Unfortunately, someone has drawn three lines on there. Wonder who that could be. It's me. For test purposes, I've just intentionally marked up this nice white table. Don't worry, because we're going to take it off. We've got three methods here. One is WD-40. That's an all-time favorite in a lot of other videos I've done. Number two, Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. We've got the name brand, Mr. Clean. So it's not a generic something or other. And then we've got some Equate, uh, sorry, generic, regular nail polish remover. But don't worry because the ingredient in here is acetone. So nail polish remover or acetone, one or the other, whichever you like to use, we're going to use the nail polish remover. So here we go. First up is WD-40. This time we're starting with the best. Here we are. We'll flip that open and just give it a little shot right on there. Okay. Are we going to be able to get that off? Let's find out. Look at this. Hasn't even been on there for five seconds and the WD-40 is pretty much taking it off. Now obviously we'll give it a little bit more. If we would have let it sit, I bet it would have came off a lot easier. <clears throat> and there we go. It's gone, you can kind of see it slightly so we're going to do it again. Fold our paper towel over. Just really rub that out of there. Okay. And there we go. You'd never be able to tell that was there. So the WD-40, unbelievable method for removing pretty much anything. All right, so here we go. Method number two. Let's try the Mr. Clean Magic Eraser. Brand new. Okay, we're using them dry because they claim they work real. Oh my goodness, look at this. Well, it actually kind of just made double the mess, but that's okay. All right, Mr. Clean has taken that thing off with just about no effort. Better than WD-40, I would say. Uh, one thing to consider is this marker hasn't been here too long. Now, obviously, if this was out in the hot sun baking, then it might be harder to remove, but I would have no doubts that both Mr. Clean and WD-40 would take that marker right off. So here we go, another paper towel, because we are ready for method number three, nail polish remover. All right, I got a generous amount. Okay, look at this. The nail polish remover. Okay, let's get some more. All right, we've hit a wall with nail polish remover. Took off that top nice layer, but it's really suffering. We're failing to get that. I mean, this thing is wet with nail polish. Look at, it's just all over me now. Nail polish remover, it's wet with nail polish remover. All right, let's try another paper towel. Maybe we need a fresh one. Okay. Someone may argue, well, you didn't pour any on. Okay. Let's just get a little there. So now it's on top of it, like we did with the WD-40. Okay, no improvement. I'm really scrubbing too. This is double the effort for sure. Okay, I'm calling that one. That one's done. Nail polish remover is not gonna work. So to the rescue, the Mr. Clean sponge. Look at this, truly is a magic eraser. I believe it fully. We're going to even touch up this other 
spots there. Let's get the cap back on this because there you have it. We have a winner. Vote below. You can leave it in the comments which one you think did the best job. I would like to hear from you down there in those comment sections. My belief, this is number one, number two, number three, because this one didn't really work too well. So I wouldn't even throw that in. The only two effective options, Mr. Clean and WD-40. If you'd like to see more videos like this, learn awesome tips, subscribe to this channel. Also, again, if you have any questions or comments, feel free to post below.